airbags could work on airplanes. They deploy clicker, then you can blink an eye. But would they really help you survive a plane crash? We're going to take a closer look at new safety rules that go into effect. Airbags for airplanes, could they actually save your life in a crash? We are back at 745, and now the new airbag in your plane. It may surprise you, but most airplane crashes are survivable, especially those on takeoff and landing. And starting tomorrow, a new FAA rule goes into effect that is putting airbags in the skies. Here's Lisa Stark with details. It seemed a miracle that everyone on board, more than 300 people, survived this crash landing in Toronto. They were helped by stronger seats. The stronger seats are going to help you uh, survive that initial impact uninjured and help you quickly move out of the cabin. The seats have to withstand impacts of 16 times the force of gravity. They absorb the energy of the crash, so the passenger doesn't. The seats are already on many planes, but will be required for any new aircraft starting tomorrow. And that's not all. Airlines are also beginning to install seat belts equipped with airbags. And we'll sew that bag onto the same seat belt that you wear on an ordinary seat. Bill Hagen helped develop airbags for General Motors. He's now applying that technology to planes. If the aircraft runs into something and decelerates at, at, a, at a great enough level to, to be a risk to the passengers, the airbag will deploy. How effective are they? Manufacturer Amsafe ran a test for us, outfitting one crash dummy with a seatbelt airbag, the other without. Here's what happened during the crash test when the dummies, mimicking passengers sitting in a bulkhead seat, hurled forward. Look again. The crash dummy without the airbag smashed his head into the barrier. He would absolutely not have survived this event. As for the one with the airbag, this person would be able to unbuckle their seatbelt and walk off the aircraft. The airbags are showing up on bulkhead seats, those behind galleys and bathrooms, exit rows, and in business and first class. Locations where it's impossible for airlines to meet new safety requirements for survivable head injuries. The airbag seatbelts are increasingly in use in private planes as well, and Amsafe says there they have already saved lives. The bag deploys in about 50 milliseconds, which is quicker than you can blink your eye. And in aircraft accidents, every second counts. And Amsafe says that these new seat belt airbags are actually safer than the airbags in cars because they deploy up and away from the passenger, not towards you. And they insist that the sensors on these airbags are designed so they will not deploy during turbulence. Robin? A lot of people are wondering that. All right, Lisa, thanks so much. Appreciate that. And we'll be right back.